Welcome to my 13-year-old son Kenny's Numismatics with Kenny YouTube channel. He created the channel just 31 days ago and now has more than 100 subscribers. Kenny writes, creates, and produces all his videos by himself. The only thing he lets me do is to help market his channel so he can introduce it to as many new coin collectors as possible. Like all YouTube video creators, he would like to have as many subscribers as possible. This video will discuss how Kenny achieved 100 subscribers in his first month on YouTube. 100 may not sound like a lot to those who have thousands or even millions of subscribers, but almost everyone who has created a YouTube channel knows the first 100 or so subscribers are the hardest to get. For some reason, he does not want me to be in front of the camera, so here's my picture. Here are a number of suggestions and your to-do list that will help you achieve a great subscriber growth rate, whether you are brand new to YouTube or have had a channel for months or even years. Try these suggestions and we believe you will see your YouTube subscriber count grow very nicely. Here's a list of 15 to-dos. Number one, include the channel topic in your YouTube channel name. Number two, pick out great channel art. First impressions are always important. Number three, prepare for each video. Whether you have a script or speak off the top of your head, speak at a normal pace. Do your best to be entertaining and limit your videos to just a few minutes. It's hard to keep someone's attention for more than several minutes. As you upload your video, you'll be filling out information about the video. Or if you already have videos up on YouTube, pay attention to the next several to-do items. Number four, the title of your video. You probably have heard this in the next few suggestions a number of times, but they are all very critical. Your title tells viewers what your video is about. But just as importantly, it tells the YouTube search engine, as well as Google and the other search engines, what your video is about. It is part of the search optimization process. Number five, your description is the second part of the search optimization process. Too many people leave the description blank, uh, box blank or would write just a few words. Search engines cannot optimize the words in your video, but will optimize using the words in your description. If you have a written script, copy and paste it into the description box. If you do not have a script, do your best to summarize your video in words and use the keywords in your description. If you look at the description of this video, you will also see that the URL for Kenny's uh, main channel is noted in the description box. Always include the channel URL in the description box. Number six, tags. Your tags are the keywords that people may use to find your video on the YouTube search engine. Take some time to think about the keywords that fit your video. Number seven, create or pick out one of your videos to be the trailer video. That is the video everyone sees when they come to your channel page. Editing is quite easy. Go to your channel page and right across from the channel page name in the blank area, move your cursor and an edit icon will appear. Click on that. Once you begin to upload a number of videos to your channel, it may be hard for viewers to navigate, which leads me to number eight. Keep your channel organized. I suggest you use your playlist for this. When you have or begin to have a large number of videos, you want your viewers to be able to find them. You can organize your videos based on their subject in a playlist. Once you have your playlist created, you could add the playlist to your main channel page and then move them up or down depending on the order you wish. Number nine, annotations. You can create your annotations when you upload your video or at any time. An annotation gives you the opportunity to have some text appear while your video is being viewed. It can give additional information to the viewer or in my opinion one of the best reasons uh, to have an annotation is to ask the viewer to subscribe to your channel. You can tie that annotation to a link. In the case of wanting the viewer to subscribe, your link would take the viewer to the main channel page. That is great, however the subscriber button on the channel page is small. If you click on the subscribe annotation that just popped up, it will take you to Kenny's main channel page. Kenny added a little bit of code to the link which creates a pop-up with a large subscribe button. Only non-subscribe members will see this pop-up. Number 10, here's the code. This is the code that you want to 
add to the end of your channel's URL. See the description box of this video to see how Kenny's URL looks with the extra code added. This alone will increase your subscriptions as you make it easy for your viewers to subscribe. Note, any annotation you create that is linked to a website can be created to open a new page. I recommend checking the box you will see that notes open link in a new window. Number 11, be consistent. Do your best to create new videos on a regular basis. It will keep your subscribers engaged and will give you more opportunities to attract new subscribers. Number 12, always remember YouTube is a social network. When someone comments on a video, respond back, even if it's a simple thank you. Number 13, one reason viewers comment is that every time they comment on someone else's video, their channel name, which is linked to their main channel page, appears next to their comments. There's a chance that the person who created the video will come to see your channel and may subscribe to you if you comment. Number 14, subscribe to others before they subscribe to you. We are all notified when we have new subscribers by email. Plus, you can always click on the subscribers icon on your channel page to see who has subscribed to you. Kenny will always subscribe to uh, anyone who subscribes to him. A lot of YouTubers do that. Number 15, share your videos on Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, forums that you're a member that discuss the topic uh, similar to your videos, and any other social media outlets uh, that you wish. These 15 to-dos will go a long way in helping you achieve your goal of adding new subscribers quickly. The first several hundred subscribers are the hardest to come by, but once you have a good sized subscription list and you stay active creating videos, new subscribers will come much more quickly. Thanks for taking time to view this video. I would greatly appreciate it if you would like the video and subscribe to Kenny's Numismatic channel or his other channels that he's just building out. Here are some annotation links. Uh, to all three channels. Kenny will be sure to subscribe back to you from each channel. That will give you three quick subscribers. Thanks again for viewing.